they're kind of two different movies at the same time. Mm, I That's think... so great the way you just put that because they do. Sorry, go ahead. No, you go. For no, it. no, 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 no. No, continue talking about how great I am. I well, love you're, really. Yeah, I you're really, genius because. <laughs> I always tell people whenever I don't like movies, I just awkwardly start the interview. You're like, hey there! <laughs> <laughs> oh, That's Jake so Hamilton, funny. Good Day Chicago. I'm like, so, it exists. It's a thing. Yeah. They finished sure. it. So special. Yeah, well done. Congrat congratulations. <laughs> um, guys, seriously, I love this movie so much. Um, thank you for taking the time. I appreciate it. You couldn't thank you. Uh, I want to kind of, if you don't mind, I'd love to start out just sort of talking about where we're at because this feels really special doing the interview here. Yeah. I'm just sort of curious what this building means to you guys because it, it's sort of where our favorite childhood memories began. I'm sort of curious what it, what it means for you. We are at the Pixar Hub in Emeryville, California, and I got to say, like, growing up as a Pixar kid and seeing all of... I don't know, it's like meeting your favorite celebrities. They've got like a turning red plushie here, they've got Buzz Lightyear over there. I get quite distracted when I'm here because I'm so excited. Yeah, no, it's the coolest. <laughs> and then the office, the offices at Pixar yeah. belong in like some kind of like active museum. These geniuses have created the coolest working spaces for themselves. Everything about this place just like screams creativity and genius. Mm -hmm. It's really, really special to be here. And have I you heard the brain thing? That it's divided into analytical yes. and creative? Yes. yes. That's so cool. Like their movie is so detailed and I'm like, oh, you're even your offices of and the way you lay everything out is detailed. Yeah. Okay, I see you. That's awesome. I love it. Uh, I've got to be honest with you. I relate to Wade on such a deep level yeah. because ever since I turned 30, I cry at everything. Good yeah. though. Everything. Good. I cry. Yeah. Wept. Ugly cry. Not even a cute single tear. Like yeah. an ugly cry at this movie. Good. Oh. What is the Pixar moment that most gets you? The one that comes to mind immediately. Like, okay, Toy Story. That was the first one and it means so much to me to this day. Up. Obviously, the first 10 minutes is going to kill you. God. Dude, for me, it was when Bing Bong threw himself off the cart and in Inside Out. I've been talking about Bing Bong since, no, like, last good. year. I love it. Uh, Sacrifice, and I also think having to grow up and trade in whatever childhood memory you had to get to the next mm. level of growing up. We're done. I don't want to yeah. talk about it. <laughs> it's, <laughs> talk it's insane. About it. It's just so sweet. So I have a nerdy question for you guys, because mm. one of the things I most love about Pixar movies is that there are Easter eggs mm. of other Pixar Yee. movies. I think Boo holds Nemo, a Nemo toy at one point. The Pizza Planet trucks are all over the place. Yeah. In Toy Story 3, Andy has a postcard from Carl. I'm just sort of curious, do you think all of the Pixar movies exist in the same universe? And what other Pixar characters would you love to see Wade and Ember meet? Somebody asked me this. At wow. the gym the other day, and I was like, I'll get back to you. You have weird conversations at, at the, the gym. gym. <laughs> it's a Muay Thai gym, we kind of know each other. Anyway, um, long, I, what, go on, yeah? I feel like the dew drops from Seoul could very well fit in here. Am I crazy oh for that? God. Or is it just because the animation reminds of each other? I don't know. I feel like right now Pixar is behind the scenes going, yeah, this sounds You're good. You're like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Pixar Cinematic <laughs> Universe. Six one and a half. I'm like, can we bring Bing Bong back <sighs> in Elemental? <laughs> Okay, I'm done. It's a pipe dream. Continue. No, that was, I mean, what am I going to continue? That's great. That's great. I'm listening. That works for me. That's Thanks. gold. Uh, I want to talk about the fact that I feel like you guys kind of have to make two movies in a way because mm -hmm. there's an eight-year-old who's going to watch this wow. and love it and then hang out for 20 years and then in 20 years go, you know, I want to watch it again and see a completely different movie. Wow than when she was eight years old. I'm just sort of curious what that means to you guys and, and what is the movie that maybe has changed the most? Because Pixar movies, they're not just for kids, they're not yeah. just for adults. They're kind of two different movies at the same time. Mm, I That's think... so great the way you just put that because they do, sorry, go ahead. No, you go for no, it. No, 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 no. No, continue talking about how great I am. I well, love you're, really, yeah, I you're really, genius because. <laughs> no, go for it. No, I was just gonna say, like, I just love that we said that because I do think that level of detail and the way they can layer is such like, you know, the, the humor and the, what, what everyone connects to like the, uh, the heart of it. Mm. it it's, it's really incredible. That's the one thing that never changes, like the feeling that you get watching that like, oh, that like up or Toy Story still has the same profound effect on me. And it's still funny, but in different ways than I remember. Sorry, mm. go on. No, but that's it though, because I think the kind of messages they push in this are super, super understandable for someone who is four years old. Yeah. But then, you know, once you use your critical thinking skills at maybe 20, you do start to see things, but it's not completely different from when it was a child. You just understand things differently as yeah. you grow up and have your own opinions yeah. too, you know? Yeah, detail. Yeah. It's annoying how good they are. I 
Like I it's, love it. I'm it's, like, it's, man. It's timeless. Yeah. They make those movies for you to grow up mm -hmm. with. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. You know? Hey. <laughs> Don't use that quote for anyone else. That is exclusively like, for this interview. <laughs> yes, that I that was gold. Good thank, one. Thank you. Guys, if you can't tell, I love you both. I love this movie. Love it really is an absolute honor to be here. This, this sort of thing isn't lost on me. So I hope you know that I, I truly appreciate your time. Dude, thank likewise, thank you. Man. Appreciate you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, we're going, we don't need roads.